Good day everyone, welcome back to another league, we're playing some fun deck here now, it's Pirate Stumpy, I'll show the deck list in a moment and I'll show it in the description for now. Look at this great hand, we're gonna keep this and let's have some fun with it. No clue yet what we're gonna do in turn one, but runs under play and let's see if they here, uh, we get to do fun stuff. So, he wins with these, fine, fine, fine. Sign of a fair deck, which could be fun for us, but also, well, fair stuff, I guess. Uh, let's see. Does the Void isn't too great against what our opponent is showing, but what we can do in turn one. So we can Emery with Lotus Petal and Opal. We then... Great Furnace to Opal is online. Then we can sack this for red. Two mana. One, two, three. Four. I don't think we can. Yeah, we can Dargo in turn one, but it's going to cost us a lot. But that's probably not ideal. I'm just going to start off with uh, casting the Emery. Go from there. So we have an Echo that makes this a lot more interesting. Since now I'm kind of interested in just playing everything out, including the Chalice and just sacrificing that to Dargo and then play, playing the Echo. I think we should have enough for that. Oh no, I can't use the lead for both the Dargo and the Echo. Yeah, this should be fine anyway. Add red with that. Twice. Third mana cost is three, so this is two mana. Yeah, we have to sacrifice one more thing. I'm just gonna sacrifice this one then, I think. Cast the Dargo, sacrifice this for blue. Ooh. Yeah, open. Um, this is not too great of a hand. I'm gonna run this out. And just cast it. Bit of a sad hand. We don't have a blue card for four, so we didn't have anything to do with our mana. And our emery just got bad. Let's see if this gets us somewhere. Wasteland. All right, all right. Let's see if we can draw something good. That would be great. Um, at this point, we're just all in on um, trying to jam Dargos and protecting it, I guess. Um, so this is one, two, three, four, five, repaid with Emery. Um, let's see, let's see. Do here. No, I think so. Uh, in which case, yeah. Okay, this was a better, a bit of a sad first, uh, first game with this deck. But, uh, Echo really got us bad. Uh, so this is gonna get them recurring wasteland. That looks bad for us. We really want another echo to get something going here, or just a, uh, like something like a bubbles or Emery uh, gets online. Jealous to protect us from future lots of blow shares. Maybe. Um, 
Yeah, probably going to jam it. Um, yeah, that's a jam. Look, we're winning the race. <laughs> This may not be the prettiest game, and I don't expect us to win it, but well, there's opportunities. Knight of the Well, that's not too big yet. Taking our one. Yeah. Give us a bubble. Bubble would be great. And then we can easily cast our Dargo. Gives us value with Emery. We have a lot of them in our deck. Um. Yeah, I think I'm just going to play this second armory, just try and find something. Gonna keep one ready. Thickness. There's a bubble, that's great. So I'm going to target the bubble. Cast that, play this on them. Cost of this now. Five. If I say this is three, let's just put the lines are done. And another card. Get this going. I think it's worth to just jam it here. We're not doing anything else with our mana anyway, so. This isn't looking too well, especially I assume they have Carcass in their decks, so they can just knight that out. But, well, this also gets Carcass, we're just very cold to that card here. See what happens. Um, yo, they already had it in their hand, they didn't even need to knight it up. Yeah, we're not winning. So I want to answer to Caracas. Well, I'll show you the deck we're playing now. It's a little fun crew. The semi-pirate semi stompy, semi-artifact stuff. It's funny. So we basically have a... Uh, Gorat, Dargos, Emery's, or as beaten creatures, and then a Echo. Set of plan with a couple of nice sets and other creatures. A couple of Seagates out with the blue can for a force of will. So against this deck, um I like trying to force of will some early plays and get ahead on board. I think we need Pitting Needle. It's uh either on Wasteland or on Caracas. Ideally on Caracas just to not die to that card, but uh I like Sinkhole as it can search favorably with the knights. Didn't see blue from them, and I, I'm not sure whether they're on Oko or not. For now, I'm not gonna bring in my blasts. Braids could be interesting just to deal with their early stuff. I don't think Chalice of the Void is too good against them. So I like having one braid over it more. I like having Brazen Borer to answer one of their uh, bigger creatures, and I think I. Got something like a Nars set. Um, I want to keep the Ice and Diamond Echo package on the play. This is just so good to turn one it. Just dump a couple of artifacts and do this. Very easy. Could see having more abrades just to interact with their stuff a bit more. But that would have to be over a Force of Will or one of the cards then. Hmm. Yeah, maybe on the on the draw, we need to be more reactive. Now I like just jamming powerful stuff, hoping we get there. Um, looking for Pity Needle and Caracas, and then just uh, jamming Targos into their face, but let's see yeah, if that works. I don't think this is the matchup for this deck. Between Source of Closures and Caracas, there are a lot of cheap um, answers to 
both Dargo and Emery. So. Yeah, this is not a great hand, but this gets me a fresh seven, so I'm just going to keep it. Fresh seven with a land in play. We'll see. All right, I don't have too many fetchables, so I think I'm going to fetch before Land Echo. Hope they don't have a ley line, since then our hand is very bad. And as you can see, this is a bit, bit of a fun deck. Our team fun deck here. Um, I played one game with it, which went very well. Surprisingly against Delver, but it's not a... Uh, yeah. Optimized for fun kind of deck. Specifically optimized for win rate. But I, I still wanted to try uh, Dargo out. I gave it a bad rep in my set review, and then... Everybody agreed, of course, the card's just not that great, but I had yet test whether it was actually that bad or whether it could do stuff. And I've been playing it on turn one pretty consistently thus far, but um, not everything, of course. Uh, so let's just go for it and hope we don't get screwed over something. Um, well, that wasn't too great. Uh, in this case, I'm just gonna... We have... Drawing into a land, so we're not really going randomly and running them without any land. Um, I like running out just one of the zero manas to hedge against uh, some of the stuff they could have, like a... Uh, a challenge on zero, but not both. I don't think that life need to have. A creature maybe you see it see for dried arbor, okay. Good here. More bubbles. Well that wasn't exactly what I would um Oh I should have bought myself with my rainforest definitely silent so I'm definitely running out plans more bubbles uh, bubbles would be very good in game one we really were looking for them now and we play a lot of them but now they're not the best of them Does mean that um, Dargo we draw off the top gets a bit better since I will helps with casting it a lot. We need some uh, stronger stuff. I don't know what. Or... Basically, a very turn one, two broken stuff deck, and after that, when we have to actually pair our cards against our opponents, like two, three, four. And I dropped it's not that great anymore. Let's see. Oh, they have another land. Shame. There's Zenith probably for. So we have a couple of brazen borers and a couple of upgrades, but other than that, we're pretty sure by that. Let's run that out, and we can only play once during the one day and jam the 50 silence and we're gonna throw it all out there. We have to go something like raid into other good stuff, but it's very unlikely that we win this one.
in there, they're getting in there. Right? Guns. Oh, great. I think we turned over our. Uh, Let me check, let me check, let me check. Yeah, we own it. Too fetch. If they play anything big, strong, or hard to deal with here, I think we can scoop it up. So I don't think we have mana to play our uh, removal spells anymore. Yeah. Sure, sure, sure. That was a very bad first showing. <laughs> we tried to do fun stuff, but our, our um, uh, echoes just really bad sevens on our side. So. Good luck next round, opponent.